What's up guys? We are back at it again. Nick's over there hitting some putts right now. But uh, we're gonna do uh, another nine hole match for you guys. We're out here at Dark Horse Golf Club in Northern California. Uh, we've had rain the past couple days, so it's gonna be wet. I think we're cart path only. And yeah, it's gonna be fun. Don't, don't miss it, Nick. Don't miss it. Oh, he missed it. Oh, that's a good putt. All right, first tee, we are headed over there. We're gonna drive down the cart path right here. Say hello to uh, the starter who doesn't exist. And uh, we are gonna be on our way. All right, guys, beautiful first hole here at Dark Horse. We've got, what is that? 447 to the green. We're going downhill, dogleg right. As you see, you got all that hazard there uh, lining the fairway. So really tough tee shot to start off. And then uh, you see way down there through those trees, uh, right of that bunker way out there, there's the green. So. Where'd it go? I barely uh, got over the hazard on the fairway. Okay, it nice. Plugged. Yeah, guys, so sorry about the uh, little target thing there. I don't know what I did, but I can't fix it, so my bad. Start it that far left though. Oh, that'll be fun. Just over the cart path. All right, guys. That is my ball. That's pretty awful. Am I zoomed in? Yeah. All right. So yeah, you can't even see it down in there. And the green's way down there. So we are just gonna try to punch it out in the fairway. So I've got about 200 yards here. I've got a five iron choking down a little bit, trying to hit a little baby fade at the pin, but it didn't work out. All right guys, so mine just ended up on uh, the hill right of the pin, good distance, but I hit a little draw out of that lie and I was trying to hit a fade so didn't really work out for me but Nick's looking good Nick has about 190 200 yards left to the green here um, the course was really wet today so hitting out of the rough was extremely difficult I got over just short of the green. So when I set up the tripod, I thought you guys would have been able to see me but apparently not, so sorry about that. But I'm just off uh, to the left. So just a couple things about my putter. Um, I just got a brand new one. 
I had been using mine for 13 years and I went from a blade style putter to a mallet style putter um, that's also about five inches longer than my old putter and I went from a jumbo size grip to a super slim grip so it's kind of this is my second round using it and I'm still getting used to it so this is hole two it's a par four that'll be perfect about 415 yards but it's straight uphill so it plays more like 480 it's uh, got fairway bunkers so it requires a, a very accurate tee shot and yeah it's a pretty difficult first two holes on this course and you know the third hole is actually pretty hard as well So this is my second shot. I got the uh, ball below my feet in the rough and I'm just trying to get something anywhere on the green from here. So this is Nick's second shot. He hit a great drive, uh, left himself in a really good spot about 145 yards out and he's Dick's one, just center green, a little deep. He hit a good one. All right. So this is my third shot here. I'm in the bunker. I got an uphill lie, so that's going to influence the ball to go up higher and softer. So I don't open up the face as much as I normally would. So, yeah, I just kind of keep my hands low and make sure I accelerate through the ball. Go in. Great shot. Line. Told myself miss high today. I think you need to get that big boy grip back on there. Alright guys, so Nick is two up in the match. We are at hole three. It's 235. Pins in the back, so it's playing like 245. Um, requires a really good tee shot here. So I'm hitting a little knockdown three wood here. This is my best executed shot of the day. It's basically the only shot no that happened exactly as I visualized Please. it in my head. So I was really happy with uh, how I played shot. this hole. Great hole. All right, guys. So that's me on the green there. Got a pretty long uphill putt. It's like 35, 40 feet for birdie. And then we got Nick here short of the bunker. All right, about pin high, a little left. Not bad. Nope. Ah.
Thank you. Woo. All right, guys. So just finished up that 235 yard par three. Um, we took a nice little three wood off the tee and got a two putt par. So we're back to one down on the match. Nick won the first two holes. So uh, hopefully we can get another one back on this par five coming up. Hole number four here, pretty cool par five. Um, I don't remember the exact yardage. It was like in the 550 range, but as you can see, I caught it really low on the face here. I was uh, pretty lucky that I even cleared over the penalty area. All right, guys, so you know that golf shot that when you're standing over it and before you hit it, you just feel comfortable, amazing, and you just know something great is going to happen? <laughs> yeah, this was not one of those shots. Nope, dude. You're in play. All right, this is Nick's fourth shot, I think. Gotta get up and down here. All right, not bad. <laughs> Five. Thank you. Thanks for watching part one, guys. Hope you enjoyed. I will see you at part two.